Tuesday's Pets on 2, sponsored by the South Carolina Stingrays. Time now for today's Pet of the Day from the Charleston Animal Society. Kay Hyman is here with us back again, and you have another adorable puppy with you. Tell me we about do. her. By the way, our dog last week was adopted as soon as I got back to the shelter. Oh, that's awesome. We had awesome. seen her on air, and they were waiting for her when we got back. So thank you so much for that. This is Daphne. She's a five-year-old um, lobster slash um, brown chocolate lab. <laughs> <laughs> She's ready for Halloween. She's a real, real sweet, sweet girl. And I did want to talk a little bit about Halloween safety with your pets. Uh -huh. If your dog is not, it gets crazy when people ring the doorbell or knock on the door, please make sure you put them in a back room. You don't want to have any accidents with children at the door. Or, um, strange costumes can really scare animals, so make sure you mm -hmm. don't um, let them be loose while that's happening. Keep them secure in your home while the kids are going around this Thursday. Well, definitely some smart tips. And tell me more about Miss Daphne. Oh, so sweet. Like, literally, <laughs> we'll put her head in your hands for pets. She's a love bug. And um, very calm, very good on the leash. Uh, got right in the car like she'd done that a hundred oh, times. Good. So she's like a latchkey dog in that she's really, <laughs> really... Um, easy going and going to be a great um, companion for someone. Of course, she's an older dog and she's going to have some medical issues that mm -hmm. we'll go over with you. Um, but if you're willing to open your heart and your home uh, to a new dog, uh, especially if you have an older dog and you're looking for a friend or yeah. if you have an older person in your life that really would love a companion, she's really good. Uh, walked very nicely on the leash. And she's been great here in the studio. She's Loves just been everyone. calm. She really likes the camera. You're getting a nice view of her. Oh, look, oh, there now you she go. She's down. a tired little lobster. She's today. a lobster on the bottom <laughs> of the ocean, ready to go. Hilarious. So, okay, do you guys have any special events coming we up? We do. Our biggest event of the year, Paws in the Park, is coming up November 16th. You guys are a big part of that. Um, it is at Riverfront Park. You can sign up to walk, run, or just come and um, raise money, or you can come just to the festival where you can purchase oysters and all kinds of other food. There'll be bands, tons of fun. It's in lieu of our chili cook-off this year, oh, and, and we'll be doing that next year, our 20th annual. So please um, go to charlestonamelsociety.org uh, and sign up for Paws in the Park today. All right, that sounds great. And if you need help finding that link, you can head on over to our website, countonto.com. We'll get that all that posted for you. And unfortunately, Miss Daphne, we're going to have to wake you up. Your time's Come up for get today. Come my lobster. <laughs> yeah. She'll give no. you lots of kisses. <laughs> and yes, always, if you want Daphne, you guys know oh. where to head. She's a very sweet pup. Ariel.